Baby G, due April 1st, 2023. Britt is 12 weeks pregnant. We went in today to hear the heartbeat again. And yes, that's my birthday. I might have to share it. Call it an it. Baby G. Baby G. Baby G. We won't be finding out the sex anyway, so it doesn't matter. This is baby's front face. So can you see? Is a that a hand? There's yeah. an elbow here. An elbow. These are hiccups. Can you guys see that oh. little rhythm right there? Baby is the hiccups. Baby is the hiccups. Here and grab that shot here. Suck it up. And then I can point it out to you too. So, oh, my goodness. eye socket, eye socket, nose, mouth, chin, elbow, up to a hand right there. Look at that beautiful little thing. <laughs> you got hiccups just like your mom always does. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh. oh. Cushion here. <laughs> so right, you're the then, one who's been making me so sick. <laughs> worth it. These are little legs down here that we've got. And then this is baby's spine. Can you see the little yep. white lines? That's oh, yeah. the spine. And <laughs> there's the little arm. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> oh, Britt is 12 weeks pregnant. Great. What do you got here? Baby's heartbeat is 163 beats a minute. If you guys haven't seen these before, I hadn't. This is uh, a heartbeat that, what's bear. They actually recorded, that was the actual heartbeat of the baby. They recorded that just today. They recorded on a little heart shaped uh, recorder and then they put it into the stuffed animal and then you squeeze it every time you want to hear it. 
So we got this for the baby and this is a onesie that I bought for the baby but also for the announcement because it's Rainbow Baby which means a, a, a child born after infant loss or pregnancy loss. Like a little miracle baby. A little miracle baby. A science baby. Science baby. That's right. Thank you, science. IVF success. First try, too. Yeah, we got very lucky. First shot. Yeah, we still have one embryo left. So there might be a second second one coming down the road in the future. We'll see. If it doesn't happen naturally after this, maybe our bodies will just know what to do. Yeah, but it's been very, very hard for us not to say anything. Very hard. Very hard, but we wanted to wait until we were sure that uh, the baby that baby had a heartbeat and that everything was well. Baby was healthy, and we saw it today on the uh, ultrasound. Baby had hiccups. We saw it <laughs> moving around, wiggling. It was very, very exciting. So. Extremely surreal right now. Also, because aside from feeling like I have the flu 24/7 for the last seven weeks. I don't feel anything. I'm not showing or anything, but it'll be a while yet. So that's the big news. I don't know if you've uh, figured it out or not because I'm very bad at keeping secrets. <laughs> and I kept rubbing my stomach in videos I noticed. Yeah. I don't Every know if anyone else noticed, but I caught it after he put them together. Everywhere we go now, she's always got her hand on her stomach. Gotta always protect protecting baby. baby. <laughs> We're not going to find out the gender, if it's nope. male or female, until, uh, until he or she gets here. Yeah, we already have two names picked out. Whether or not we'll use them, we'll see. We gotta meet the kid first. Mm -hmm. right. We're not gonna tell you the names. No. I'm gonna try my best to keep a secret. Well, it's easy to keep secrets on the blog because it's not live. And you if I accidentally, yeah, I can edit it if I let stuff slip. It's just when we live stream, I've gotta be very careful. Yes. <laughs> We're just calling them it, he, possibly she. Baby. Baby G. Baby G. Baby geese spray. Boy or girl, we don't really care. Either oh. way, as long as they're healthy. Mm-hmm. I finally get what parents mean when they say that. Yeah. You really do not give a crap <laughs> what sex they are at all. As long as they got a strong heartbeat, good lungs, good brain, they're gonna have a good, fulfilling life. You're happy. We have a pregnancy app. Uh, what's it called again? Pregnancy Plus or Pregnancy something? Plus, I, yeah. I can't remember. I have the husband part of it. You can either put it, like, install it as the husband or... As the father or the mother. The father or the mother. Yeah. Yeah, pregnancy with a little plus sign. Did I say the husband? The husband. Husband yeah. of the pregnant woman. You guys know what I meant. You don't gotta be married, though, to make a baby, as we know. <laughs> <laughs> In his case, he's the husband. And uh, it actually shows what the baby looks like right now. I don't know if you guys will be able to see this or not, but uh, it's a little bright. Uh, if I go a little closer, there we go. That's actually uh, what the baby looks like. You can see the little lungs in there. See the heart. Oh, I don't know if you can see the heart beating yet, but you can follow week by week. And that is in your belly right now isn't that weird it is you have a little human inside of you mm -hmm. who's been making me very ill <laughs> she's had crazy crazy nausea and morning sickness bad and not just morning morning noon and night yeah she's been sick non-stop since about five and a half weeks so that's why she hasn't been showing up in the vlogs as much because usually when i'm at home she's very sick and not looking so good looking a little yeah. green around the gills yeah so. we didn't want to give it away and we uh, didn't want to get everyone all excited until we were uh, confident in sharing the news so yeah today's the day yeah today we got to hear the heartbeat and we got to see baby and heartbeat is very strong mm -hmm. uh, so we have some more peace of mind we just wanted to get closer to the end of the first trimester before we shared any news because well Especially for those of us who have been in bad situations with pregnancies before, it can be a little bit of a, a nervous time. And I have been very nervous. And I explained to them, <coughs> excuse me, I explained to them too that uh, uh, the risk of miscarriage, it's, it's very high in the first little while, the first trimester, and we don't want to announce it to the entire world online, 
get everybody all excited that, oh, they're pregnant, and then have to announce that it didn't work out. It just kind of adds a little extra hurt to the situation when you gotta yeah. reiterate things and re-examine and, and explain, because we've yeah. been there before. And on YouTube, it doesn't end right away either. People watch these videos years later, and then they're still sending us messages and comments. Oh, how's the baby? Is the baby there? Or or what happened watch. to the baby? And then yeah. they didn't watch. They don't know. And then you have to relive all of the the, the hurt the, over the hurt that it uh, yeah. didn't work out. So it can be very difficult. Been there, so. done that. We weren't going to do that again. So.